everyone, welcome back to the channel, and yes, I have returned. For now. <laughs> uh, yeah. I was not feeling great the last couple of days, I'm still not 100%, but I'm like a good 97-98% of the way there. So, here we are, I'm back, and I've got some Marvel news for you guys, as you'll have seen in the thumbnail and title. And, well, it pertains particularly to the release dates and release schedules for Loki Season 2 and Echo, the Hawkeye spin-off. Well, what do we know? Well, as I said, the release dates. And the release dates for these shows are as follows. Loki will be coming out <laughs> with its first episode on the 6th of October. So that will be the start of the second show of the year of three. And the other one, of course, is Echo with... November the 29th. Now, I want to point out the um, release schedule for these things because it seems that Marvel, yet again, is experimenting with um, the release schedules for their shows. And, Loki, they're releasing week by week, as they have done with every show previous. So, WandaVision, Falcon and the Wind Soldier, ETC, ETC. However... They're trying something different with Echo, and I'm guessing they're releasing them both in these ways, is to compare them. And the way they're releasing Echo is that on November the 29th, all the episodes are dropping on the same day. Which is going to make predictions and overviews borderlining on impossible, so I don't, I don't think I'll be doing an overview slash prediction series for Echo. Which I'm very sad about, because I can't lie, I was looking forward to doing that for, the, for that show. But unfortunately, Marvel has decided against doing it that way, and I'm assuming they're using it as a test bed to see if it's worth doing that going forward, which ultimately would mean the end of Marvel predictions and overviews altogether on this channel. So, have to keep an eye on that, to be honest. Um, but yeah, Loki, I'm really looking forward to. Of course, we had that little teaser in the post-credits of Ant-Man Quantumania, which was just epic as hell. I was so happy to see that. But also, I am really looking forward to Echo. It's going to be weird watching it all in one go, because, come on, guys, it's me. I'm going to be watching it in one go if I can. But yeah, I'm just kind of gutted that they have made that show the um, one that they're kind of lumping all in one day. Again, I'm curious to see how that goes, because it could be good for Marvel, obviously, but, again, if they do switch to that permanently, that would mean the end of Marvel predictions and overviews on this channel, because, of course, I do them week by week, so the videos aren't, like, three gajillion hours long. But, yeah, as for Loki, I will be doing overviews and predictions for that, as usual, and I will be doing them from, for Secret Invasion. I'm still to figure out what to do, with episode 3, because of course I am actually on holiday when episode 3 comes out. Yes, it is episode 3, so I'll figure that out soon and I'll let you guys know a little bit closer to the time. But yeah, I just want to give you all this little bit of an update on what Marvel's doing with the other two shows this year. By the way, this is so weird, only having three Marvel shows come out this year. Like, I know that's been the same for the last couple of years, but they've kind of released them at pretty frequent intervals, whereas these these three are kind of jumping about very strangely, like we've got Secret Vision coming out in only a couple of weeks now, well, I said like just over a month, and we've also got Echo and Loki releasing together, so it's a bit weird how they've scheduled them this year. I'm hoping that next year the release schedules are a bit more um, spread out like they were for last year's show, so Moon Knight, Miss Marvel and She-Hulk. And, of course, the 2021 shows, WandaVision, Falcon the Wind Soldier, and Loki Season 1. But, yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys, on the release dates and release schedules for Loki Season 2 and Echo the Hawkeye spin-off. So, please, like this video, subscribe to mine and Roxanne's channel. So, link's in the description. My sub button is, of course, down there. Please click both our sub buttons and our bell icons to get both sets of our notifications. Comment as well, because why the heck not? And let me know what you think of the um, conflicting release schedules of Loki and um, Echo, and which you prefer. Once you've done that too, please follow me on my social medias. 
That'll be in the, in the link tree in the description. Although that's going to be Roxanne's website. And lastly, of course, please do share this video with all of your friends so they can join the infinite loop of liking, subscribing, commenting, following, and sharing, and around and around and around that loop. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Goodbye!